Hello, uh, so yeah, that's the problem that I got over here. Uh, I already put the VFD outside. I had it in here inside of the box. I got all the the three, um, I'm just running with the three, uh, three axes. I got a three um, uh, step motor drivers. Uh, and that's the thing. So I click X minus and it goes in one direction if I click X plus goes again in the same direction and uh, I'm gonna put it here for you so you can see it so X minus X minus one side X plus as well the same y minus goes away x plus and the stepper is doing a, a very strong a strange uh, noise as well i just had it to run it before with the arduino with the uh, garble and it was working perfectly i just got this uh wasted board with it so and the z the z is fine z i got uh up and down goes up goes down Z works good so the thing is everything is connected properly uh, I ch double checked a million times already everything is connected properly I've got uh, I'm powering with the, this this thing is 12 volts uh, 2.5 amps is more than enough to to power this thing I got either 5 volts that they are all bridged over there, five volts for all. Uh, you see, five volts is the green. The the yellow is the direction. It's all the direction, all in the same spot. It's all connected. And the red is the, the pulse. All the red the pulse are correct, connected over there. So the the thing is, when I move, this dx to the to the four and the five everything works good so is this thing is is, is something wrong with this thing i don't know who, exactly what it is uh, you give me a minute now i'm going to change exchange the the x and the y to the f uh, to the to the a and the b or four and five and you're going to see that the, the dx is going to move uh, properly uh, just told them Hold on a second. So now I change the X and Y. I got here the Z. I got here the A and B. So now everything is connected exactly the same. Direction, uh, pulse, everything. I'm uh, gonna reset over here. And uh, now Z, up and down, up and down works uh, now the a it's you see moves in one direction moves the other direction perfectly the b or the five moves in one direction and moves in another direction so it's not the connection it's everything is connected correct it's just the x and y axis is something wrong with this thing i don't understand if i go here to the machine and as you can see uh i don't have uh, limit switches are all disabled all disabled uh, the motors are all set it all the same way i got it uh, for 400 per, uh, per, uh, 400 steps per revolution uh, the step of timer is uh, yeah it works uh, it's for every every X is the same uh, this is just the direction and even here when the with when I use the uh, X and Y when I change the direction uh, it doesn't it doesn't doesn't do nothing always goes in the same direction so it's it's something it's, it's not correct in here it's something really it's really a shame because i really like this uh this uh 
this controller it works one uh, it worked one week with it and uh, was perfect i just made this new box i moved the things to here at the beginning i thought it would be the, the vfd was causing interference but i got all uh, cables they are all insulated it's all insulated cables but uh, yeah I even put it in the, the VFD, it's turned off, it's completely turned off, but uh, see, if, uh, oh, okay, exit, and soft limits, I have it all disabled as well, soft limits I have all disabled as well, so, uh, it's, so it's, uh, I got uh, limit switches are now disabled as well, because I already broke one, because of this situation, and uh yeah i got uh, everything is disabled over here uh output uh, i got everything turned off controller uh, i don't know if uh, something uh, this this part here i don't understand correctly but i didn't change it i just left it as it was uh so i didn't change anything so yeah i don't uh, i really don't know what is wrong with this thing but something is not correct input i got all disabled as well the spindle i don't have it connected to the to the controller anyway so uh auto gm uh, this is uh, yeah this uh i'm not sure what is this as well i never use it so i just left it uh, like uh, uh like it is and uh yeah and the rest i don't know what what uh, what uh, and uh, with the mpg works the same is the same thing it's is the problem the uh, i'm not uh electronic engineer but the problem is this doesn't give me the pulse that it should that's the problem yet with the uh, x and y because when i change it to the to the to the fourth and the fifth everything uh, works perfect but now if i don't i don't know how to slave the 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 axis because i'm thinking about for the, uh, the beginning just working with four axes with this machine so if i could uh, use the fourth and fifth axis so at least i could use uh uh, a three axis uh, controller which is yeah this is a controller for five axis uh, it is i don't know what happened uh, i have everything connected uh, perfectly uh, i know there was no uh, the machine looks on the outside and and the screen everything looks fine it just uh, doesn't uh, doesn't work uh, this axis i don't know what, what what the hell is going on and it's not the problem uh, with the connections over here because i tried and uh, I, 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 uh, I tried everything and I even running with uh, with, uh, with the Arduino with the carbo and uh, it works perfect and yeah if the connections would be bad so this ones uh, wouldn't work either uh, but they do so yeah see go up and down five and so it's Y works up and down and the Z up and down the only problem is that i'm using the fourth and the fifth or the a and the b axis and i need the y and the x uh, and this ones are, are scrambled i don't know what the hell is going on well i hope you you know better uh, and you could give me a solution thank you